Hey guys, so before I've done a summer essentials video, but more for fashion and style and things like that, and uh, when I've done that video I said I could do another one of like um, showing products and things like that, and a lot of people said that they like to see that, so I thought I'd do that today, and so it's going to be mainly kind of makeup and a little bit of hair and stuff like that, and actually I wasn't sure whether to include like random items as well like miscellaneous things and I couldn't think of too many things but there's something that I wanted to share with you guys it's a new app and but when I was traveling and when I was on holiday recently there's just so many times where you're like you know hanging about and waiting and stuff like that so I thought I'd sh share with you guys um, this app it's called fresh and basically what you can do on it is you make your own account, and when you make your account, it's quite cool, it like asks you what kind of girl you are, and then it kind of calculates the shops that it would think would suit you as well. And so you have like your, your main menu, so you have home, stores popular, you can browse like through all the stores, so they have like Brandy Melville, that's one of my favourites, and they have like Nasty Girl, Misguided, Motel Rocks, loads on there. All the most popular stores on it, and you can browse what is like coming in, what everyone's liking, and then you can like them as well, like like that. Oh, that's really nice. Oh my god, I actually wanted that bikini. <laughs> For example, on my page, you just have your own feed of what you've been liking, and then you can buy it as well from the app. So I just, I think it's really cool. It's very like um, clean looking and easy to use. It's just handy to have um, all year round really, but I thought I'd include it in this video as well. You can download the app from the app store or you can click, I'll put the link down below in the description box. If you like beauty and fashion and things like that, then I thought you would like this as well. Also, if you download this and then tweet or Instagram your feed from the app, you'll be entered into a competition to win a thousand pounds worth of clothes via Fresh. Just make sure you use the hashtags Fresh App and Beauty Crush. Okay, the number one thing is obviously suntan lotion. I just, I can't not include it, it's really obvious, but um, this is the one I used when I went away recently, the Piz, Piz Buen, Piz Buen. <laughs> I don't know how to say it. Okay, I just got Factor 30, um, and I like this one actually because it has an inbuilt pump, so it's quite um, hygienic. Well, it doesn't get really, really messy in your bag, so yes, and I, I like the smell of this one as well. You want to keep shielded from the sun and all its cheeky rays. This is something that's been quite a new discovery of mine. I've used them before just to leave in conditioner for your hair um, but the sun really easily can dry out your hair in particular and also if you're on holiday obviously the sea salt and everything like that. Sea salt. <laughs> um, so this is one that I've really been liking. It's the VO5 Miracle Mist. This smells heavenly. I love the smell of this stuff. Um, it's. Uh, I carry it around with me to kind of spruce up the curls, make sure they're not, you know, dropping or drying out. It says it has elixir with five natural oils. Rescue tired, damaged, dry or frizzy hair. So it's just handy to have around and just go and smell it like in, in boots. It's really nice. Next might be another really obvious thing, but if you're in the sun, I don't, I tend not to wear foundation if I'm in the sun, especially if I'm away and it's really hot. But if you really, really wanted to have a little bit of coverage, I'd suggest tinted moisturiser. Or just make your own by just literally get a little bit of your foundation and just mix it with your moisturiser. Um, but this is a really nice one. It smells nice and it also has SPF 30. If you're going out at night as well in the heat, it's just a lot lighter. My next essential is uh, perfume. This is one of my favourite perfumes. It's, the, it's Daisy from Marc Jacobs. Um, but I wanted to kind of talk about this in particular. Um, having it in one of these little bottles because it's really handy to, car to carry around with you. I know you can get these in the US, this is from Sephora and I don't think you can get them in this form in the UK but I was gonna say just make get one of those little travelo things, they can be really handy if you're out and about um, in summer and you just want to like spruce up and smell nice. Next is for if you're in the sun and if you're like me and you don't really wear foundation, I make sure that I have either a suntan lotion for the face um, because the body ones can be a bit heavy for the face and might clog up your pores um, or I've got this one from uh, the body shop vitamin C moisturizer but it's SPF 30 so you've got the protection in there and vitamin C is really really good good for the skin I love using vitamin C in rich products I wasn't an eyelash curlers girl for ages I don't know why I just never thought they made a difference but I have the sure mirror ones and I really really love them and I was using them a lot when I went away and just during summer because it's in this kind of heat you don't feel like putting like loading on fake lashes, well I don't anyway, so when I went out I'd make sure to curl my lashes and just put on loads of mascara and it really does make a difference. They just help like oomph your look, oomph your look, <laughs> uh, what am I saying, it's hot. Uh. <laughs> 
Next is a bright nail varnish, which is, I know everyone says this, but it has to be done um, in summer. And I haven't been wearing a lot on my fingers, but I've been wearing this on my toes. I feel really weird saying toes on YouTube. The Topshop Celestial, this is one of my all time favorite shades. I love this. I'm not gonna show you guys my toes, but <laughs> you can imagine kind of what it would look like. It's just really nice to have a pop of color. One of my must haves for summer is cream highlighter. I love it. I've, I've tried so many different highlighters, but um, this is definitely like the, my most favorite one that I've tried and I've been using it for all the time. It's Benefit's What's Up highlighter and I've lost the cap to the bottom, but it just looks like that. And it's just a really easy to work with subtle highlight but you can build it up so it just it depends how you like it and also I think it would work for loads of different skin tones and shades um, because it's quite a champagne slightly warm color and it's also light so I just throw it in my bag especially if you have a tan it really makes you look really glowy and gorgeous and stuff so if you have really oily skin though probably go with a powder highlighter lastly is something I feel like I always say and I always mention but a um, matte bronzer and I'm sorry these are more like high-end products these is just this is what I've been using recently the Bobbi Brown um, bronzing powder in natural number one I've been using this non-stop it's a really um, lovely shade it works really well for my skin tone um, it might be a little bit dark if you're fairer skinned I think if you're fairer, maybe Hoola, Benefits Hoola, um, but it's just really handy because I can use this to contour with as well, um, there's absolutely no shimmer in it. I personally like them because I don't like having too much shimmer because I use a highlighter as well. Okay, and then I, I just wanted to chuck in three really, really random products, but they're things that I found useful on holiday when I was away or that are just fun. <laughs> First thing is a disposable camera. Um, me and my sister just picked these up last minute, we were, get, we were about to board the plane and I was like, wouldn't it be fun to have a disposable camera because obviously everything is digital now which is great but um, I love the feeling of having like the having proper photos and you can't like adjust them and stuff and I don't know I just thought it would be cool also when I was away and it was really really hot like midday um, the sun's so damaging for your hair so sometimes I tie my hair up using like a headscarf this is just as an example having a headscarf or a scarf while away or a bandana no not a bandana it's just good for protection and one bigger than this that you can wear like around your body it's just really handy because you can use it for so many different things and then lastly a book um, I just always have to have a book with me just in case in case I really really get the urge to read or if you know the day's going quite slowly and it's like really chilled and it's just nice to have a little read but I picked up The Hobbit for my last trip away which I need to finish um, that's it I hope you guys like this video and I hope it wasn't too kind of obvious but it's also slash what I've been loving recently so I thought I'd share it with you guys I hope you like the app as well let me know what you think about the app let me know what you want to see from me next also thank you for all the lovely comments on my last video everyone was really 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 nice um, and it's really always really nice when you guys enjoy the videos that I put out I'll put everything that I'm wearing and things like that in the down bar I put all the information in the down bar I'll see you guys in my next one bye Mwah.